Hi, everybody. Jeff Hemmelt from SFMSports.net. After the Stevenson women fight to a 1-1 tie against number one Messiah, here with Kayla Yaps, and we'll start with Coach Graham Miller. Coach, what is in the water down there in the water fountain? The, last night, the men come out with a scoreless tie against Messiah. Your girls come out, battle back to a 1-1 tie. Just an overall great effort from your squad today. Yeah, you know, you know, building on the guys' game last night, you know, we have got two soccer teams here that, you know, coaches that have been here for eight years, players that have been here like Kaylee for four years that have worked for nights like this. You know, they've worked hard, they've sacrificed, you know, they've given up a lot of their free time and uh, not just during the season but in the off season. And, you know, we've did a lot of video. We've we've had adversity this year just like the guys have had adversity. And, and for both teams to come up against two undefeated number one teams in the country and, and get ties and, you know, for us tonight, you know, I was shooting them and, and really getting giving Messiah a go, playing toe-to-toe -to -toe with them. I mean, that just speaks volumes for the players we have here, um, the coaches we have here, the staff we have here, and, and everybody associated with the Stevenson University, you know, soccer programs. Scoreless at the half. Uh, I guess your team talk was a pretty positive one at the half. You did give up an early goal in the second half, but then a uh, Lawrence Spivey goal late in that second half equalized things up. Was it a positive message at halftime? Certainly it seemed like it, even though you want to go down. Yeah, it was a, It was very positive, the same as we started. You know, we told them about going out and having fun, you know, having no fear. Um, the first 15 minutes of each half was very important, but we didn't do what we had to do. <laughs> but in the past, you've seen our team, you know, the heads drop when that happens, you know. So, you know, that could have happened again, but it didn't. You know, the fact is we gained, you know, we've got a lot of momentum over the last two weeks as a, as a family and as a team. And, you know, you've seen the heads didn't go down. We kept going and a great run from Bella. Uh, Casey um, was able to play that into Lorna. That's our first goal against Messiah and obviously, uh, you know, took us to the tie. Just three goals allowed all season from Messiah. That's an impressive stat. And to get one against the number one team in the world, that, that just speaks volumes, I think. Yeah. Number one team in the world, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, it, seems like that, it seems it like seems the world like, to me. It seems like that all the time. You're right. Um, but definitely, um, you know, the fact that we've got a goal, the fact that we, you know, I shot them. The fact that we went toe to toe with them, we didn't sit back and, and, and we played our normal game the way we played over the last few weeks. And, and, and Messiah was probably thinking back to our game last year when we, um, you know, packed it in for the final. But we told the girls, look, I have confidence, I have faith in every one of them. If we play our game, our version of soccer, then we can take them. And we, we gave a good account of ourselves tonight and, and almost pulled off that victory. I asked uh, Coach Pleviak this last night. Um, obviously, this would be great motivation for the end of the season with this 1 1 result. Three of the last four games on the road. You can obviously, I sh I'm sure, take some great aspects from this game and put it along to the uh, last four games of the season. Yeah, you, you know, we're taking it one game at a time. We never looked ahead to Messiah. You know, we took Arcadia, we, you know, we went, we played Hood, we did Widener, then Messiah. Every game we concentrate on, we don't look forward to the next one. We, we take care of business each game and the next one's Albright. So now we get ready for Albright. We have a week to get ready, a little bit less than a week, but we don't have obviously have a weekend game. So the plan is... Let's, uh, let's get ready for the next one. Well, Coach, it might not have been the best team in the world, but it was certainly a worldly <laughs> effort from you guys tonight. Congra we'll, we'll take it as the best team. Okay. We'll, we'll, we'll do that. Congratulations on the 1-1 draw. Great effort. Thanks again. Thank you. Kaylee Yaps joining me now. And Kaylee, another great defensive effort from your squad. Again, going down early in the second half, one nothing, but again, stepping up on the back line. Tiffany McKee with some great saves, equalizing late in the game. Your overall impressions from this game tonight? Um, I am so beyond proud of my team right now. Like I'm trying to hold myself like to not like scream and yell because I had faith in us and I believed in us and this is just incredible because like you said, I've been here for four years. I, I've been with this team and we've worked so hard to get where we are right now and it's just an incredible feeling. Was it hard to control your emotions after you tied the game up? There was still plenty of time to go, and I'm, I know you guys were really bouncing up and down the sideline. Was it kind of hard to keep yourselves in check and keep the flow going? Yeah, it was. Uh, I mean, this is the first time we've ever actually scored against them, so it was definitely hard to bring ourselves back down and, like, get focused again. But I thought we did a great job to recuperate and, like, get ourselves back focused on that field, and we took it at them, I thought. I didn't think we held back. Four games to go in the season. Um, what's your strength? What's your focus going on here the final part of the season, getting into the postseason? Um, I think right now we found our groove we've been struggling to kind of find it at the beginning of the season but I think tonight was it we found it we know what we need to do now and we just need to take it to the teams and show them who we are they underestimate underestimate us and we're going to take it to them now well again a great effort from your defensive line and the rest of the squad as well congratulations enjoy this and we'll see you back here next week thank you Stevenson uh, Kayla Yaps and Graham Miller joining me after the 1-1 tie against number one Messiah here at Mustang Stadium